Well, at least Tucker Carlson is uh, on top of this. This is a 10-minute video. I, I won't play it all. I'm going to show you some of the highlights of it. Tucker says this is a disaster. And he's absolutely correct. Let's go up here to... Um, trying to think. A little bit more. Right here. Put it. The whole town may be unsafe as a result of this. Watch. The railroad company is responsible for this, and before these people went back to their homes, their, their homes should have been tested. Uh, their homes should have been cleaned. Um, from the you know from the onset, these people were being uh, marginalized uh, in, in an effort to uh, to mitigate this. And you know, at first they were being told, you know, go get a hotel and uh, keep your receipts and we'll reimburse us. East Palestine is is a very poor community. Some of these people don't have the money to go get the hotels and do all of. The and you know all this stuff this really looks like a nuclear winter and i said well you know pretty much yeah, yeah. We okay now let's see here's what you're looking at you're looking at 5 10 15 20 years down the line until you see potential long-term effects this stuff needs low-lying areas it could be in sewers, it could be in nooks, it could be in crannies, in crevices. Okay, we'll go a little bit further to where the guy lost these foxes. Yep, back up a hair. Taylor is an ODNR registered fox keeper. A couple of his foxes broke their legs trying to run after the initial derailment. One of his foxes even died. Out of nowhere, he just started coughing really hard and just shut down and um, he had liquid diarrhea and just went very fast. Taylor tells me all of his foxes have been sick and acting different since the weekend. Some have abnormally puffy faces, including the one he's holding. He says they are not eating properly. Many are dealing with stomach issues and are acting lethargic. This isn't how a fox should act. He's very weak, limp. He, his eyes are very like watery and weak. That means your kids are going to have the same thing. What happens to animals and happens to fish happens to humans. I want to thank Fox News for, for taking the time to put this out and allowing these guys to talk. Or you wouldn't get the whole news. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll put a link.